Thanks for joining us today. By the end of this tutorial, you'll be able to create and send video emails just like this example. The first phase is to create your campaign within SendGrid. So we have logged into SendGrid, selected our template and created a new campaign, which we have named Playable Tutorial. We are now going to create our video content. Firstly, we'll need to log in to Playable. If you don't have an account, it's free to join and you get full access to the console. Once we are logged in, we are greeted with our welcome page. From here, you can administer your Playable account. Today, we are going to add a new video. So we click Videos, which takes us to our video dashboard. And then we click the Add Video prompt. Firstly, we need to create a title for our video for admin purposes. We'll name ours Playable Tutorial. Next, we need to confirm the width of the video to be displayed within our SendGrid template. We'll use 600 as our width, which is industry standard. We are now ready to upload our video content to Playable. We can upload content as a video file from our computer or a URL from a hosting platform, such as YouTube, Vimeo or Instagram. Today, we're going to use a YouTube video. We copy the URL of the YouTube video and paste it into the Select Video field, then click Apply. The upload time will vary relative to the size of the video. During the upload, Playable creates a 10 second edit of the video as an option for you to use in your email, though in most cases you will wish to edit. To commence editing our video, we click Editor. Our objective is now to create the most compelling video content with a maximum duration of 10 seconds. This duration is designed to ensure all recipients receive the very best video email experience. In the main screen, you will see an area framed by a dotted line. This represents the area of the video which will be embedded within our email and is derived from the image dimensions we entered earlier. We can move this area to select a preferred area of the video. To create our video email content, we select clips from the video using the timing slider and the add clip panes. We need to keep an eye on the duration of the edit, which is shown here. Once we are happy with our edit, we click Continue. We now have the option to add a range of enhancements to our video. These are designed to help reinforce our messaging. We can add captions, which appear at the foot of the video, at time intervals we select. We can add or remove a click watermark. We can add an end card, which may be our branding or a call to action. And finally, we can include a footer with a call to action. We now click Compile. Playable now creates over 100 versions of the video. It is these which are used to deliver the very best video email experience for all recipients, relative to the device and connection type on which they are viewing the email. The next step is to add a click action. We click the menu item which gives us three choices. Today we are going to redirect any recipient who clicks on the video to the Playable website, so we add the URL and save it. We have now completed the editing of our video email clip. We can now preview our video across the major email clients and also send a sample to our colleagues for checking by simply completing the form here. We are now ready to embed the video within the SendGrid template we created earlier. To commence this, we click Embed. Here we select SendGrid as our email provider. The first time you complete this process, you will need to link your SendGrid account with your Playable account by adding an API key. This is covered in a separate tutorial. Once we have selected SendGrid, our SendGrid campaigns are shown. We select the campaign we set up earlier, Playable Tutorial. The template we created is now shown. To embed our video within the template, we hover over the image we are replacing. This now glows red. We then click on the image. We can now see our video within our template. To send this template with our video embedded in it to our SendGrid account, we click Create New Campaign, followed by a click on the prompt, click to view your new campaign in SendGrid. We have now successfully embedded our video into our SendGrid template and we continue to test and send our SendGrid campaign in the normal way. 
Thanks for watching and please get in touch with any further questions.